Make a Million with Anton B by Angela Banner. One day, Anton B wanted to play. But all the toys were broken. B said they could not play cards with only one card. And Ant said they could not play ping pong with only one bat. Ant could not walk on one stilt, nor B knit with only one needle. They could not play with one bit of jigsaw or one marble. There was nothing to play with. There was naught, zero, nothing. Ant said they must make some new toys. B said that they would need glue, string, paper and wood. Ant and B found some glue and string and paper and lots of old paintbrushes made of wood. Ant said there must be a million bits of wood. B said there were not a million bits of wood. Ant said there must they must count the bits of wood. Ant and B counted all the bits of wood into piles of ten. Ant counted ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty bits of wood. Ten and ten and ten and ten and ten makes fifty. Then B counted ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty bits of wood. Ten and ten and ten and ten and ten makes fifty. Fifty and fifty makes a hundred bits of wood. Ant and B thought about what they could make with a hundred bits of wood. Then Ant and B said they could make a raft. Ant wished B had counted a million bits of wood. But B said his sum showed only a hundred bits of wood. B said there were not a million bits of wood. Suddenly, Ant began to argue with B about how to make a raft. So B said they must share the hundred bits of wood. Then Ant could make a raft and B could make a raft. Ant and B shared the hundred bits of wood equally between them. Ant had 50 bits of wood and B had 50 bits of wood because 50 and 50 makes a hundred. Then B slowly made his raft with his 50 bits of wood and lots of string tied into knots. Ant laughed and laughed and said, So many knots may be strong, but knots are trouble and look all wrong. Then Ant went to make his raft. Ant broke all his 50 bits of wood in half, and then Ant had 100 bits of wood, because 50 and 50 makes 100. Ant made his raft with a hundred bits of wood and lots of glue and paper. Ant made paddle wheels and a sail for his raft. Ant laughed and laughed and said, I made my raft quickly and stickly. B had a raft and Ant had a raft. When the rafts were on the water, Ant laughed and laughed and said, My raft is fast and has a mast. Suddenly, Ant began to shout, Help, help, Bee, save me! Bee, save me! Ant made a lot of noise because his raft was sinking. Ant had used glue to make his raft and the glue had washed away. Bee saved Ant. Then Bee laughed and laughed and said, Your raft was fast but did not last. Then B said they must make a bridge over the water so his raft could go under a bridge. Ant said they must make the bridge with a million stones. So Ant and B went to find a million stones. Ant and B found lots of stones. 
Ant said there must be a million stones. So B said they must put the stones into piles. Ant and B put a hundred stones in each pile. Ant said there must be a million stones. And B said there were a thousand stones because his sum showed only a thousand stones. B said there were not a million stones. Ant began to argue with B about how to build a bridge. So B said they must share the thousand stones. Then Ant could build half a bridge and B could build half a bridge. Ant and B shared the thousand stones equally between them. Ant had 500 stones and B had 500 stones because 500 and 500 makes a thousand. Ant wanted to make his half of the bridge with mud and stones. And B wanted to make his half of the bridge with string and wood and stones. Then Ant began to make his half of the bridge and B began to make his half of the bridge. Then Ant and B were pleased with their big bridge made of a thousand stones. Ant and B ran about on the bridge laughing and laughing and said, the best bridge you ever did see was made by Ant and made by B. Suddenly Ant began to shout, help, help B, save me, B, save me. Ant made a lot of noise because the rain had made the mud on the stone slip. Ant's half of the bridge was falling down. B saved Ant. Then Ant said, The silliest bridge you ever did see nearly fell on top of me. Then Ant and B flew away to find a million things that would make a million toys. Ant and B found a cushion and 10,000 pins. B said a cushion with 10,000 pins in it would be the biggest pincushion in the world. But Ant said no, as 10,000 was not a million. Then Ant and B found 100,000 beads. B said 100,000 beads must make the longest necklace in the world. But Ant said no, as 100,000 was not a million. I must find a million things. Ant wanted to find a million things, but B was tired of looking for a million things. Ant asked B to count to a million, but B was sleepy and did not want to count to a million. So Ant said he would count to a million, then B went to sleep. But when B woke up, Ant had only counted to 300, so B went to sleep again. But the next time B woke up, Ant told B that he had found a million things. A million things? Then Ant showed B a big pile of sand. Ant said there were a million grains of sand. A million grains of sand? B picked up one grain of sand and said... Yes, I will not bother to count as I know that your big pile of sand must be made of a million grains of sand. Then Ant and B made the biggest sign castle in the world with a million grains of sand. The end. <laughs>